Hey guys, Dave here. Uh, I want to do a little pre-update update on Clutch 24. So we just did uh, the egg cutting on that one, I don't know, a couple days ago. All the babies are coming out. Um, and then we had three of them who had started basically falling out of the eggs. Um, they're not absorbing their yolks, but they're deformed. So like I said, when we did that egg cutting, uh, there was, I think, two eggs that were like 52 grams or 54 grams, and one that was 50 grams, and I believe all three of these were in those smaller eggs. Uh, so again, the pairing on this was a pastel cypress hypo, and the female is supposed to be a leopard, enchi, butter, super pastel, fire, het hypo. Uh, so I'm not going to go over the whole clutch, but... I'm going to show you those three animals that are deformed. Um, so if it's something you don't want to see, please let's end the video. Uh, I'll completely understand. No need to watch if you don't want to see them. Um, but I, they obviously, they won't be here. Pretty much they won't be here by the time we do the uh, update video. So I want to make sure you guys saw the three. And... Um, yeah, just a bummer. Uh, they're all really good looking animals, but one is just absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna grab the camera, lower it down, and I'll show you these animals. All right, so this first one right here, try and get the camera to, there we go. As you can see, it's all kinked up. Pretty rough looking. Uh, it also, it does have eyes, but you see how it's just all messed up and spazzing out and whatnot. You know, you can never really test or you can never really go by what you see when you have these animals that are genetically messed up like this. Um, you know, I could say this is probably pastel leopard enchi. I don't know. Pastel fire leopard enchi maybe. I'm not really sure. But then again, the pattern could be as whacked out as it is because of the deformities as well. <clears throat> so I don't know if this is incubation. I'm not sure. Uh, we did lose power when we had our power outage. I don't know what it was a couple a month ago, maybe three weeks ago. But we did have power still like within four or five hours. Um, so I don't think that's what it is. I just think this is just a, one of those bad clutches. So that's one. The second one looks really nice. I think this is a pastel, probably a pastel fire lesser. You know, I don't know from there what else it could be. Hypo, it is hypo, but it's got a little bit of a cleft lip, upper lip, and no eyes. So, it's a deformed kind of a crushed skull right here in the front too. Well, unfortunately, this one, you know, even though it looks all put together body-wise and its nose and mouth are there, it's definitely, I don't know, <clears throat> I have a problem with ever considering giving these animals to anybody. Um, they obviously can't be bred, and people could say, well, it could be a pet or whatever, but I don't know ethically if it's right for me ever to even give away something like this let alone sell it so unfortunately they'll probably be euthanized but yeah that's just a bummer and then the last one here i mean look at this so i don't know if this is a result of incubation or what the way it looks leopard lesser what super pastel I don't know if there's Enchi. I mean, it's just crazy. This thing is really crazy. But it has no eyes. And it's really thin. And I just don't think it's going to make it regardless. So, there's that one. Alright guys, so again, that is Clutch, what, 24. Um, unfortunately, just the downside of breeding, the downside of doing this... Is sometimes you have animals that just don't make it for one reason or another again I don't know if it's incubation issues I don't know if it's 
a pairing issue with whatever jeans. I don't think so. You know, I'm not sure. All the others look great as of right now. I've checked them all over. They all look great. No issues with eyes. No issues with cleft palates or kinking. So we're still going to have, what, uh, I think six or seven really nice animals still. Um, and then, like I said, unfortunately, those three will no longer make it. But uh, I just wanted to update you guys on this clutch because when we do the cutting, you know, it looked like we had a lot of really good animals in the eggs. And, you know, sometimes people get a hold of me and say, you know, hey, I thought there were like four more animals or two more animals. Well, here you go. Now you're going to know why when we do that update, three are going to be missing. So that's it, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, we'll see you on the next video.